morning guys and welcome to today's video it is the crack of dawn sam's down there feeding the horses because we have riding lessons really soon but before that happens i have to tell you guys something do you guys remember what my rule is for seeing signs i shared in a past video with you guys what uh what happens what god does to let me know something how god speaks to me he sends me signs and my girls all know this the sign is if i notice something unusually it's like this weird feeling that happens to me and i see this this and i see something three times like i might see the same sign three times in close succession to me that's a sign that it's going to happen it's not foolproof but it has been working for me for a lot of years and i use it as a guide for my life anyway so you guys saw on a couple of videos ago shh, that we were at the beach and gabby fell she fell, you guys. You guys know Gabby never falls. So she doesn't fall off the horse. She doesn't fall on the ground. She doesn't trip. She doesn't fall ever. And then yesterday, she was walking over the rocks and she fell again. And then I was like, oh my gosh, you guys. What if she's going to fall soon? But I was like, you know what? That's only two signs. That's only two signs. Not a big deal. Then, last night, she was playing. I was cutting the grass in the arena. And she was playing with the horses in the field. And didn't she step back? Willow stepped on her toe and she stepped backwards and she fell on her butt and I was laughing so hard and I wanted to cry because even though I've joked I do not want Gabby to fall especially if she's gonna fall off of a horse but there you have it today or this week might be the day or the week that Gabby falls off a of horse I did not see it I did not dream it I just got the signs and the signs are the least reliable out of all of my signs but yeah I got the sign you guys this could be the time that Gabby falls please pray that she doesn't fall I do not want to knock her confidence she worked really hard to get where she is but anyway good morning welcome to today's video our house is a mess we have riding lessons at the crack of dawn with Brandon with race car driver it looks glorious out there let me show you this sky I feel like God is trying to tell me with that sky that there's a sunrise hanging right over top of our little barn don't look at that dirty window. Gabby, how do you feel your ride is going to go today? I don't know. What are you working on? Are you working on anything? No. What have you been working on? This is your last... Legs. Yeah, legs. That's right. Show Brandon how you can do it now. He has no idea. He has no idea that Gabby's mastered a few things. All right, not mastered, but she's doing better at a few things. My goal for today is to canter through the fields with, the ha with my hair blowing in the breeze. Yeah. Yeah, no, gosh, no. You don't my... even have any hair. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it does not blow through the breeze. But anyway, my goal for today, my goal for today is to shut the heck up. <laughs> does that make sense? Yes. Yes. <laughs> anyway, uh, I came to my attention that maybe some of you guys think that when I'm talking in my lesson and I'm complaining or making excuses for not doing something, I am not. I'm an expresser. Oh, uh, you're express. an excuse maker too. I am kind of an excuse maker too, but it's more like when I'm riding and they say do this and I say it's hard. It's not. I'm not saying I'm not doing it. I'm saying I'm trying my best, but it's hard. I'm just going to keep working at it. It's hard. I'm, I'm not like saying I'm not going to do it because it's hard. I, I didn't even think that anybody would think that until yesterday. All of a sudden I was like, wait, maybe they think that I'm like saying, no, I'm not going to do it. But yeah, that is not me. But anyway, today I'm going to shut the heck up. And I'm just going to ride a quiet and do my best. When your trainer likes candy, you make sure you have candy. Uh, no. No, no, no. Come on. First you no, have to ride. No. We'll take these. So when our trainer comes to the barn, no matter what the trainer, I always like freak out a bit about one being late and two everything being clean. So you better believe it that we came down last night and did a clean. I put new shavings in. Hey, handsome. I was thinking about Storm today, how slow he is. He he's just like he's not slow. Once someone once told me that Storm is not slow. He's just uh, smart. He just like why rush? When you don't need to. So he is, uh, when he needs to rush, he, he can rush. 
It's just that he doesn't need to. Like, what? What? Yeah, Where are does. you going? Like, why are you running? Right, Storm? He's yeah, just, he, he even eats slow. He's just a calm this horse. Is why he has a stall guard? Because he's a calm, amazing horse. Finn, on the other time, Finn, on the other hand, is a stress case like all the rest of us. Sophie's kind of a relaxed girl. Oh, Mom, you have a bite right here. Oh, so Finny, you got a bite? You got I'm a bite? Oh, Finn. Right, we gotta get going. There's Dad down there cleaning up all the horse poop before the trainer gets here. All right, Stell. Hey, Dad just suggested we put a gate here. Let's do it. I'd much rather yeah, a gate. where I found Storm and Finn. Where? At the back of Finn Coopin. Yeah, that's what they do. I actually love grooming up, tacking up, and grooming in the stall better. Okay. It's like better. You have this? Fold okay. it under. Fold it through. Okay. Oh. Well, that's a new one. All right, I'll be back. Thanks, Gabby. No, you're not coming. Stay there. Uh-oh. Oh, good Lord. What the heck? Get back up, Missy. You close the door. Stella, get back there. Close the door, you guys. What? All right, so Sam let Willow out. Oh, she's just right there. Watch the camera. Okay, let her in. Good girl. Oh. Crisis averted. No, she always goes in her own stall. So I was trying to put her in stall so she could be caught. So it's good with her. She jumped in between the fence. Oh, she did that yesterday too. I couldn't figure it out, but she knocked down part of the fence. Yeah, she's she's a mini. I feel like Willow's getting us ready for something. I know! moment that you realize you're smarter than you think. Gabby. Yeah. Thanks, Mom. That's not the thick one, though. I need the thick one. Which one? There's three or four. I need the big, thick. Here's a big, thick one in here. All right, let's do it. Let's go. Oh, okay. Her saddle is not done up tight, but that's okay. Let's go. It's just you and me. Why are you snorting? Is it because you're by yourself? Hey, don't you trust me? Don't you trust me? I trust you. Stella's in heat. She's like, don't tell them. So rude, right? Don't be looking around, feeling nervous. It's all good. I got you. So one thing I've learned about Stella is that when she starts the snorting, I mean, she's feeling nervous. So uh, yesterday we cleaned up all this. And we cleaned up all over here too. With the lawnmower, the horses ate pretty much all of this. Oh, you're okay, they're coming. Oh, it's Ruby. It's Ruby, come on Ruby. No, there's none of that. It was a trick. She acted nervous and scared and looked behind her so I would let my guard down and let her eat. Ruby, do not poop in this arena. So anyway, we cleaned up all that. So I'm not gonna lie. 
every single time I'm, I ride, I have nerves every time. Even when I stop thinking about it and try not to think about it, I still have nerves because it's hard not to. But I just got to trust. You just got to trust. Just trust. I trust you, Stella. <laughs> she looks away. <laughs> She's like, don't trust me. Don't put it all on me. It's okay. We'll be. We'll do it together. And I spy a trainer. Handsome trainer. Oh, here comes Sophie. Finn's going home. That's why he's in front. He's like, I'm going home. <laughs> he's going home, I bet. <gasps> yeah, he's going home. Okay, so our lesson is finished. And uh, I'm going up to change because we are going to Horde Station, which is our sales barn, just because it's a fun thing to do in the summer on Tuesdays, because soon we won't be able to go at all because it'll always be too cold. But yeah, torture myself. Anyway, we had awesome lessons. It was hard. We mostly oh, kept quiet. Is it? Listen, did you, what did you like about your lesson? You learned your, once you square up your body, like don't lean forward over the jumps. Oh man, it makes a difference. And you were learning lengthening your stride instead of pushing him forward. I was just pushing him forward. I know, but he, but he instead of like trying to go faster, instead of trying to go faster, he's lengthening his stride. It's really good. Sophie, what did you like about your lesson? Jumping. What? Jumping. Yeah, it was good. Every time we go to the sales barn, we learn new things. Last week we saw a little miniature horse that um, had laminitis really bad, and I learned a lot from that. Sometimes you learn more from seeing things that you don't want to see than you do seeing things that people explain to you. Anyway, that's why that's one of the reasons why we go. We all love to go. We all love to see all the pets and dream and imagine and that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go there and probably it's gonna be a regular Tuesday thing. I don't think we're gonna see a horse today because I'm going, but also Brandon is supposed to be going there. So we'll see if there's a horse at Word Station. I think he's picking up a trailer too, maybe. What do you guys think? Is there gonna be a horse? No. I think we're gonna get sheep. So that's what happens when you ride at the crack of dawn. You know when Sophie's got her purse with her that things are going down. Why do you have that purse? Look at their cute little butts. Oh my gosh, I want to hold one of them. I like the bunnies. Yeah, the bunnies are cute. Look at the pigs. Adorable. I like this grandma. I want to hold a pig. I like the brown bunny too. These guys are super noisy. Look at this rooster. Other than it's been pecked, don't you think he's beautiful? Was he similar to our rooster? No, he's different. Oh yeah, look, see he's got the... That's what our rooster's gonna look like. Holy cow. That's what our rooster's gonna look like. Yeah, look, he's got the big fluffy face feathers. See? Still a lot better. Yeah, they're all losing fur. I like these ones. I said better, not bigger. Yeah, look at how big. I wish I could get him without the sun. There we go. Look at how huge he is. He's like massive. We're gonna have a huge rooster. I like them too, Dalmatian chickens. Aren't they so cute? These ones are really interesting looking though. Aren't they neat? I love the color combination, that cream and brown. Aww, a mama with her babies. I want her. Just joking. You have to hold them. Two hands. Two hands. Oh, he's cute. 
Oh, he, he, yeah, he's adorable. I take full responsibility of him. No. Uh, nice try. How much are they? Too much. I have money. Here, put them down. I want to hold them. The biggest mistake was letting my kids have a bank card. Mom, 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 mom. That was the one I was going for. Oh, he's cute. Here, I want to grab him. Hi, buddy. There's no getting away from me. I hope you know that. There's no getting away from her, little guy. I asked him. I know. It hurt very bad when he tried to get away, but I just kept on holding on. Hi. Oh, he's cute. Hi. Don't get excited. The, the babies are underneath her and one was poking his head out. It was seriously the cutest thing. Oh, wait, I wonder how much a chicken and all her babies are. Oh, there's one. Watch. Oh, do you see her but see down there? <coughs> under her under her do you see it? Chest. No breast. Underneath her breast. Aww. Aww. What? I, don't know. I just heard somebody say it. Somebody heard Gabby just heard somebody say there's three horses. Mm. <gasps> That's what I need. No, this um, won't fit Stella. It's too small for Stella. This is um That's what like I need. a lead rope. But it's oh, like that's this a kind, nice a kind. Oh, well, I can't I'm not use that. Sure. What would I use that for? I'm not it's sure how big this is, but it's a pony or a top size. So It's adorable. For the western <gasps> saddle. Oh my gosh, for the mini? For the western saddle. For my saddle or yeah, for? Yeah, you hook this over the horn. And then Brooklyn and Jacob can have stirrups. Mom. Oh, you hook it over the horn and yeah. it's extra? It's like stirrups it's, for Brooklyn and Jacob? Yeah. Okay. How much are they? Sorry? How much are they? 15 bucks. It's true, every time Gabby comes with us, she's like the person who explains everything to us and shows yeah. us what we need. So this Look is over there. Pony. Look at over here. I'm, I love cages. Cages are my thing. Come on. I'm going to well, you don't have any animals to put in. Yeah. this, and then I'm going to get a guinea pig, and it's going to be all good. Yeah, it's going to be all bad, because you're not getting it. I actually like collecting bits because you can never so this pinchy. Is the, this is the no, mom. You know what this is called? That is called a uh, pinchy bit. Yes, but it's called French, French leg pinchy bit. a slow twist. Twist. Snaffle. Snow full, twist. Full twist. I have no idea. Why. That's a straight bar. Slow twist. Full cheek. But none of these are soft it's a full like cheek. the ones that this we have. This is full cheek. Yes, oh, got I it. I want to get this for my... Um, no, we're never going to use those. What size is this, Gabby? Oh, I just got pecked by a picker. <laughs> it's horse. It's horse? I need a mini. It would fit Stella. Is this it Western? Is no, it's English. English. Yeah, I think it's. I thought it was English. Yeah. Lots of people here that recognize this today that did not say hello. Oh my God! There's a paint in the chestnut. Oh. Oh my God! I see them. It has the eyes. Soft, like push right one has a bad injury so we met this girl before you guys oh. might remember she might oh good lord oh do you think it's recent it looks mm. recent but it's not bleeding anymore but it's still obvious and it's still on the pus and everything we have a friend that that happened yeah i've got a couple of horses that are blind in one eye but not like that and then she also has a stifle issue. See how her leg turns in at the back? Yep. And then this guy has wolf teeth. So they're in the middle of his mouth and they're really, really painful teeth. So when they have that, they can't eat as easily. So he is very, very skinny. How do you know all this? 
Very you just look? <laughs> Very experienced. Yeah, I checked his teeth and everything. I was just in there. They're all really, really calm. Well, that far one has like yeah. yeah. All right, so tell us about the chestnut. That one has a bad shoulder. I can tell from. Oh yeah, it's swollen. Right there. It's very swollen. She's got long feet. Almost a founder, but not quite. But she looks young to me. Apparently, she's a companion mare. Was never ridden, but I think it's just because of his shoulder. Yeah. And then he has wolf teeth. So, so how do you fix wolf teeth? You can actually just file them down with your vet. Jeez. So this yeah. horse is going through all of this just because he hasn't had his teeth. Loaded? Yeah. Well, I think loaded. Brandon will buy him. He's, you, Brand, your idol is about to be here. How do you know him? Uh, I used to ride with him in shows. Oh my god, isn't he the most handsome man you ever met? Yes, and I had a crush on him. Oh, so uh, was Sophia. Well, so he's coming. Oh my god. Oh my god. What's your name again? Crystal. Crystal. So they obviously all came from the same place. And yeah. you know what? Uh, we know a uh, horse that had an eye like that, and they mm -hmm. took care of it right away. Those teeth. Yeah. Those ones. Yeah. Aww. Aren't supposed yeah. to be there. But he looks somewhat middle-aged, older, I would say. But Aww, he's, he's friendly, yeah. They're all just so cute. Well, geez, it's hard to have energy to fight when you're skinny. And all their manes, they don't seem like... Except for this one looks like it's been pulled recently. Yeah. So it looks... Well, not recently. It does not look pulled, does it? It looks... It looks like Stell's mane after it was pulled. Like, pulled oh, I thought America. you meant the missing part in the middle. I oh, didn't... no, it's just flipped over. But mm. it looks like she was a show horse. That's why I'm thinking... Oh. She wasn't rideable is what they say, but... I think she was rideable until that happened. Yeah. Which is obviously somewhat fresh as well. Yeah. It's also that is. But all... Everything else on her seems fine, except for her feet are a bit long. I just don't understand. If you have a horse in trouble, they just bring them here when they don't want to deal with them. Yeah, don't. They can't afford to deal with their health. I know. It's true that it's it can happen. Yeah. Like, look at this. Move over for just one sec. Look at this. Like. They're just trying finally to make her so sad. Her eye could be fixed, but her back leg is definitely not right. Mom, she'd be a good companion for Stella. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she'd be a good companion for my vet bill. I've been watching your videos see how she's looking for companion horses. Perfect one right there. She can't even do anything. She, yeah. They'd all run her. No, that's true. Except for Stella. <laughs> So I think he's beautiful, and she's got a beautiful personality. This one's been timid since I got here, but she was way over there. She came over here, so... And she wants to be with her friends. She likes... I think she wants attention, but she's just like kind of... So sad. Like, Gabby, have you bonded with this chestnut? I want that one and this one. I want... Oh, there we go. We need all three. Yeah, we need all three. Thank God we don't have a bigger farm. That's all I can say. Yeah, we someday. Yeah, we are. So we bought this and this. So I look over, I'm in here with the chickens. I look over and this girl's sitting on my lap. Like they don't, they're like, they're not afraid. Do not peck any of my toes. Do not like, yeah, our chickens are so friendly. We did not buy another chicken. We did not buy a cow. Too friendly. We're trying to friendly? integrate Izzy with the crew, and they are not being very friendly, especially the rooster, which is to be expected. Don't you do it. Sophie's a chicken, crazy chicken girl. Hey, I don't, I'm not. Like, Molly, if you pick her up, she just sits there. Yeah. It's okay. Yeah. If you just sit in their coop, they just hang out with you. Go! Oh, jeez, no. Louise! Go! Oh! Don't bite my feet. You're okay. You're okay, Izzy. It's okay. She's like, I don't care. Put me. She really wants to be friends, though. Like, she really wants her friends. We should separate you. Anyway, um, it's unfortunate about the horses. It makes me sad. It makes me sad that I'm <laughs> I wish somebody could vlog this. We're sitting in the chicken coop and all the chickens are on top of us. <laughs> Don't come near me. Don't bite my feet. Don't claw my feet. Don't. Uh, it totally made me sad. It's 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 disheartening to see. And it's 
sad to know that if you mistreat your horses to the point of no return, you can take them to a horse station and sell them without any repercussions. But I can't help but think about how behind every horse in bad condition is an owner that just did not know lacked the resources, lacked the skill, lacked the money, lacked a lot of things and that it got to that point. And so I pray for them and I feel bad for them just the way I feel bad for the horses because I can't feel good to have animals don't. Mom, make sure she doesn't in jump that kind of problem. And you actually do pay a price when you take your horse there. You don't get to find out where it goes. You don't get to follow up on it. Like you, it's essentially, it's just sad. But anyway, that is it for today. Bye. -bye. Say goodbye. <laughs> she did. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.